All right, guys, I just got done with a meeting and we got a call. Let's get the door open. Come on. There we go. Doors open. Let's jump in. I already got my kit on. There we go. Fire up. Come on. Here we go, boys. We're pulling out. So it looks like there is a motorcycle accident. Let's hang a right. And it, it sounds like it's uh, it's a male on a motorcycle, like a mile away from here. Watch it for the trees. And he's wearing, okay, he's wearing a firefighter uniform. Okay, that has to be Garrett because Garrett rides. Garrett, one, is late to work, and he rides one of those sport bikes or crotch rockets. And, oh, here he is right here. Okay, we got to the scene right now. All right, let's pull over here. Lock it off. All right, Garrett, man, are you all right? Man, what's it, where, hey, what hey, happened? Hey, 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 dude, you're like spinning around. Sit down, sit down, sit down. Man. Put your back on the tr tree. Crouch down. There you oh. go. Yeah, just relax. Let's, uh, okay, what happened? Here, Garrett, here's a... Uh, my head hurt. All right, let's get an IV in ya. I think that's gonna be best bet. And then I think ambulance is on its way right now. So we'll take you down to the hospital. But dude, you wrapped this bike literally inside the tree. What happened? Where's, where's, who called it there, in? There was, uh, there was like a vehicle. Where did it go? Yeah, let me, uh, here, let me pull out of the Some, way here. I got, like, someone, like, cut me off, man. Where are they? Uh, dude, there's, like, tire marks on here. So somebody, what way were you going, Garrett? I was... You are going to I work. Don't... You were going this way. You are coming yeah, down here. Yeah, okay. I'm, I, like, working with you. Okay, so Garrett was coming down eastbound, and this is Main Street, and somebody, somebody pulled out to the right here. Here's skid marks to it, and they must have sped off. So it was a hit and run. Well, Garrett, your bike does not look like it made it. It's literally inside the pole. Why don't we get you? Here's uh, here's some water right now. It looks like, I mean, I can't really tell. You could have some internal bleeding or stuff, but ambulance is in route. They'll be here in a second. Okay, my right foot is in so much pain. All right, man, just take some weight off it. Wait, what do you want me to do? Kick, like, kick the left foot because my right foot hurts. And then, like, okay, I'll be in there you go. Pain. I jumped on it. Ah! Dude, not that hard. Well, he said to even it out. Let me, uh, I, I, ambulance is coming, man. All right, the paramedics just pulled in. Let's go ahead and get the stretcher off. Garrett, let's get you on here. Come on. Man, this thing's kind of hard to get off. Oh, man. Here you go, I'm Garrett. Can to you? feel dizzy. Let's just stay down. Stay down. We're coming with the stretcher, man. Oh. There you go. This happen? Can you just sit on that and then we'll lay you down? Yeah. There you go. Oh, and then just hurt, lay down. Just hurt. lay down. Oh. There we go, buddy. You're good. You're good. We got you strapped in. I'll go ahead and push you across here, okay? Okay. These tree branches are very annoying. Okay. Yep. Just uh, we'll get you. We'll get you pushed across here. Thank you. Thank you. All right, Garrett. We're gonna lower you back down. There you go. We'll get. We'll get. Uh, we'll get you strapped in. Okay. It's not gonna be. The hospital's right around the corner, so we'll get you in. Okay. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. All right, Garrett. Straps are on. We're shutting the doors. Okay. I'll try it. Uh, not drive too hard. So you think foot? Your head was spitting. You said anything else hurt? Man, my entire body hurts. Did you see the tree? Like I smoked it. Yeah, I saw it. You probably went flying a good fifty feet until you stopped. It looks like. But yeah, we'll get you to the hospital here. Yeah, the uh, the authorities know they're working on it right now. Do you have a description of the vehicle at all? It was a Maserati. Oh, Maserati. All right. Yeah, that's some good information to tell them they should. Was it black, silver, red, green? It was silver, man, like most of them are. Okay. No worries, Garrett. One more uh, turn here, and we'll we'll be here. Whoa, whoa. Take these turns easy, uh, man. Th this road isn't good. This part of Main Street is not good. The hospital knows you're coming in, so they're going to uh, treat you for trauma and a head injury. So oh, once you get all cleared, which I think you will, I think you'll be just fine. I hope so. All right, here we go, Garrett. Do you think my motorcycle's okay? Uh, yeah, your 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 bike is pretty good. All right, Garrett, we're here. Let's get you in. Doors are opening. Perfect. Thank you. You gotta remove these straps. Oh yeah, forgot, man. I always forget the controls are up here. I don't usually run the paramedic ambulance, but go ahead. Let's get you raised up and then up and out of here. There we go. Not too bad. And then let's push you in, Garrett. Good luck, man. I will see you. Uh, hopefully I'll see you soon working. Yeah, man. Thank you. Thank you. All right, Garrett. Good luck, man. Thanks. All right, guys. Let's pack up. Hopefully, Garrett's doing good. So that is, uh, I, I always told him, you know, you know, riding motorcycles like on your own private property is one thing, but then going on the road, you just got a lot of dangers with other people around you. So I never really, I mean, I didn't tell him to not to ride, but I was like, dude, I don't know, maybe, maybe you know, maybe you don't need to have a motorcycle and stuff. But hopefully, you'll make it. We're heading back to the station. 
and hopefully the cops get that guy so it was a hit and run which means for those who don't know what that means is somebody gets in an accident and many of the times they 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 leave or sometimes they leave and you call that a hit, a hit and run and sometimes why people do that is because maybe they don't have insurance or the license is suspended or something along those lines where if they they get caught they're going to be in even bigger trouble than just somebody if they accidentally hit somebody so let's go ahead get back in here all right guys we got another call i'm already leaving forgot to turn my camera on but it's, we're on the interstate so i gotta make sure i get out here first the ambulance is right behind me police aren't even on scene yet i think we're actually the closest one so i'm gonna get out there got license sirens going i gotta stop the traffic here slow 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 all right nobody's coming i want to make sure nobody passes me but it sounds like it's a vehicle accident and it's one person one vehicle i believe they had trailer problems or something it sounds like oh no okay we are we we got told the wrong information we we were told it was eastbound it's actually westbound let's get on the other side here all right perfect there's an emergency vehicle turnaround that is very lucky all right i was the wrong police are already on scene and have cones out so that is good news there we go an ambulance should be right behind us all right guys ambulance should be right around the corner we have the jaws of life out i think we might need to use it it looks like the the driver might be trapped in the vehicle and the door's a little jammed up so i just gotta pry that open here there we go put it in open it up yeah it's kind of swished back can't get the door open you can see how the panel's kind of bent there all right i think i got it loose there here comes the ambulance all right here's the ambulance there we go we should have door open good to go pop it open all right let's get the stretcher come on come on come on all right there they are and the driver she is a little, she's kind of out of it right now so here we go ma'am uh yep got your arm here we go doors open all right there we go we're gonna get you on the stretcher here here we go all right let's push her in good thing we got this all coned off blocked off don't have to worry about traffic that's usually the most dangerous thing all right let's push her in here but she's a trooper she'll make it good thing that police officer got here on scene good all right one two three up and in here set her down and lock it all right she's strapped in looks good we'll shut the door and we're moving good thing we're on the interstate because we'll be able to fly down here and take the last exit and we'll literally be at the hospital probably faster than we were this morning when we were doing the motorcycle one but we're like five times as far so let's get flying but we're gonna take her down to the hospital they should be ready for us if you guys enjoyed today's episode please smash the like button if you haven't already subscribe as well and I will see you in the next one. Yee.